Wowzers. That rain is coming down faster than a shooting star. Huh? Oh, sweetheart, I'm fine. I'm just... Wow. Look out there. Oh, are you... Are you a little timid? Oh, Sweetie, it's perfectly rational to become scared from hearing the sky grumble and rumble and <laughs> make such uh, interesting sounds. Huh? Was I scared? Oh yes, absolutely. I know I try to act, you know, brave and stuff like that, but yeah, I used to be scared. Well, once upon a time not long ago, I was a little girl, and when those dark clouds came in, <laughs> get this, I used to think supervillains and aliens and pirates and whatever would jump out of those skies and eat me and my family and the whole block I lived on. <laughs> what? What's that face for? I watched a lot of supernatural shows and films growing up, so definitely shaped my mind into a more fantastical, whimsical setting. <laughs> but I'm getting off track. I mean to say, honey, is that it's okay to be scared when you're a kid and as an adult now. Oh yeah, when those flashing lights would go like, blah, 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 blah. I used to be like, mommy, daddy, where are you? I feel scared. <laughs> Oh, I'd be crying. Oh, my goodness. Stuffy nose. Just tears dripping down my little cheeks. Oh, my goodness. Poor six, seven-year-old little me. <sighs> yeah. And I would run to my room. I would bury myself in all of my toys and my plushies. Oh, my goodness. I would clench on to my Scooby-Doo plushie and my Build-A-Bear plush. Ugh, Charlie. I loved him. He was my knight in shining furry armor. <laughs> yes, my teddy bear. Ugh, just I was scared out of my mind. And it just it just freaked me out. Like, why is the world making so much noise right now? Why is the sky making so much noise? You know, I used to think that somebody was angry. Like the like the clouds would cry. And the rain was its tears. I know it sounds kind of odd to say that, but I mean, I used to think the weather had a personality. Sunny days meant the sky was happy. Foggy days, sad. Rainy days, unhappy. And thunder days, like, whoa, stay out of the way. <laughs> but I understand now with the weather channel meteorologists and you know that nah the weather just is what it is <laughs> no emotions required <laughs> but it it's it's interesting but what I'm trying to say is you know there's nothing to fear I'm here and it'll be okay we'll be just fine hmm? how am I so certain <laughs> Because we are in our own corner of the world and we're snuggled up, cuddled up in our soft blanket and we have each other. We have each other. And that's what's important. I'm not alone and neither are you, my dear. Besides, I can ask the storm to leave. <laughs> I'm joking. But I would try to, honey bun. I would pack up my umbrella, walk outside on the porch and ask, Excuse me, your thundery excellency -ness. <laughs> Can you please cease your noise? My beloved and I need rest for tomorrow. <laughs> well, I would want to be polite to the storm. <laughs> I wouldn't want it to shock me. <laughs> and then what? You'd be all alone by yourself because I'd be a fried toaster oven. <laughs> but you get my point. I would try even if it failed. Oh, I love you too. And now, with my trusty powers of tenderness, I can raise my hand to the ceiling and say, 
Presto. No more storm. Wait. What? Oh. My. Cupcakes. The storm just stopped. Or it just rolled through. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. That was pure coincidence. Don't look at me like that. I am no superwoman, wonder woman, or weather woman. I was making a joke. <laughs> if I really had superpowers, trust me, you would know. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, that's that, I suppose. <laughs> I'm super to you. Aww. Honey. I am just an everyday human who happened to make a joke that stopped a thunderstorm. We're gonna, we're gonna pretend this didn't happen tomorrow. <laughs> we could get back to our regular scheduled business. <laughs> but, okay. Um, can we turn on the news, please? Because I need to see the weather report immediately. 